Hello everyone and welcome back to this channel. As you can see, I'm going to be doing uh, what I got for Christmas video. Um, as I said, like I do not want, this isn't me bragging and being like, oh my god, look what I got. Um, I mean, I suppose in a sense it is because you guys want to know what I got for Christmas. But I am in no way trying to make anyone feel less than from this video. Um, you guys voted for it and here we are. So I'm just going to jump right into it. Um, I'll I have to put some pictures because I left some stuff downstairs. Um, but I'm going to start off with what I got from Santa Claus. Because um, I feel like my little sister will watch this. So. Okay, so the first, um, one of the things I got, which... I love so much like love 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 um i got the beauty works waiver kit which looks like this um which made my hair was a lot wavier yesterday like i brushed it out and it's still pretty cute so that's exciting but i love this so much it comes with the travel case and everything um and with that i got the beauty works i think i put the thing on upside down but i got the beauty works limited edition bundle where it's the invisible dry shampoo and their stronghold hairspray which their hairspray smells really nice i really need to get their heat protecting spray because i don't actually have any and apparently their one is really good um so yeah i really need to get that um but i love it so much it's so good um and i love the way that molly may uses it um to make our hair like all nice um, and I also got um, the DKNY Stories perfume it smells amazing it's my favourite perfume um, but they got it in, the, in a big size and I'm like so happy I know the, this perfume is like really expensive so like I'm very appreciative of getting a size so big because I don't know why certain perfumes are so much more expensive especially if you go higher up um, but yeah, it's my favourite perfume of all time. Um, but I, there is so many other perfumes that I love as well. Um, that's just my like top one. Um, I also got an electric toothbrush. Um, I actually did get one a few years ago. Or was it last year? I can't remember. But like I got one some point recently. But they discontinued it. So I can't get replacement heads. So I had to just get like a new toothbrush. So I'm really excited about that. Um, it will be good obviously if you can hear any shouting my mum's watching the hibs versus rangers game or rangers because rangers are at home and then hibs are away so if you do hear any shouting in the background that'll be why but then she's also watching the manchester united game so then there's also that but moving on i also got vans i forgot to bring them upstairs with me they're downstairs but they're just the black and white vans um but i've been really wanting a new pair of vans so i was really shocked that they got me vans because i was like but really appreciative because obviously like van like shoes aren't re relatively like cheap you know what i mean um i also got a pink top that i was wearing yesterday which i'll put a picture somewhere um so that you guys can see it and um, it was really nice and it was just for a top for a top for me to wear on christmas it was really comfortable it was from boohoo um so there was that and it was really exciting um in my stocking i got a hib hibernian fc cadbury's chocolate bar um I got the lavender, laid back lavender from Party Light, which is an essential oil for my diffuser, which I was running out of actually. And then a little 2021 calendar, a eh, calendar, notebook. Is it, is it a cal, it's not a calendar. What are they called again? No, are they, they're not, they're not calendar. What are they called? Like a notebook, but like with dates in it. Oh God, I sound so dumb. I just forgot the word for this. <laughs> But yeah, that's what I got from Santa. Um, and I will move on to what I got from... I maybe leave Greg to the end because, as per usual, Greg kind of went overboard. So I will move on to what um, my cousins and my grandma got me and then, like, his brother and then, like, his family and then we'll move on to Greg. So this is what I got from my grandma. Um, I kind of want to leave that one last so she got me a jaggedy thistle scotland dash hound pin which is so lovely like i love this so much it's so cute and i cannot wait to use this she also got me this i'm sure it's a notebook um yeah it's a definitely a notebook 
um, which looks like this. And you can put some things in and, you know, like make some notes. And it says, it has words on the front which say, To my granddaughter, never forget how much I love you as you grow older. You will face many challenges in life. Just do your best. Life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass. It's about learning to dance in the rain. Every day may not be good, but find something good in it every day. Laugh, love, live. Follow your dreams, believe in yourself, and remember to be awesome. I'll always be with you. Which is so lovely and so thoughtful. And I just love the words on this and the idea is so lovely. Um, she also got me, it's in this cute little bag. It's from the company Chalk, which she sells in her shop that she has. And it's a hot water bottle, but it's a long hot water bottle. But it's one like that you can like put around your neck if you have like a sore neck or like at, on your back or like lower back and like around your stomach and things. Um, because some like when my IBS flares up, like I get like aches everywhere, or like sometimes when I have Mother Nature, like it can be very uncomfortable, um, in a lot of different areas. So that is going to be well used, and it's such a lovely color too. Okay, so I love this so much. So a lot of you probably have seen in videos or on Instagram that I have this blue bag that's like a French bag, um. So because I my grandma sold that one in her shop. She also got me the black one, but this one came with the little bear and the little scarf thing um, on the side, which is so cute. Um, so it says, Un voyage merville, merville's, I think is how you say it. Um, and then you just like pop the things up. And you get the look there's a little thing in there and then you get the strap inside so it's so lovely i love this bag but apparently she can't she can't get the the blue bag anymore so i think it might have been like a limited edition in that color which is so cool i was like i kind of i'm like that person where i'm like you can't there's nothing wrong with having the same bag in different colors because then it means that you can have the same bag that you love and have it go with other outfits because it's like a it's not like a blue that you could probably wear with everything. So it's at least there's a black one to actually go with things. I'm really excited about that and I'm really grateful because they're so lovely and like she remembered things that I love and would actually like to use. And from my cousins, they got me the Devil Wears Prada Miranda Priestley Funko Pop. How cool is she? She's so freaking cute. I love The Devil Wears Prada. Like, obviously, if you watch my top five movies, you would have seen that Devil Wears Prada is up there. Honestly, I love that movie so much. Like, it came on the TV and I was so happy. Like, my favourite scene is probably where... Um, oh my god, I just blanked on the character's name. And where he walks in, he's like, all right, everyone, share your lines. And then, like, when Miranda Paisley's just like, that's all. And like that's it like it's oh i love it so much i was hoping it was on netflix or like now tv or anything but it's not and i'm like so tempted to rent well like to buy it on like apple tv because it was only like 3 99 so it's like not even that bad so i'm like definitely probably gonna do that they also got me the free from kitchens free from chocolate bar which i'm really excited to try um i love trying different brands of like dairy free chocolate um because i can't have dairy that much so and I've found that being more on a vegan diet has actually really helped my IBS a lot. So you won't hear me complain about it so much. <laughs> so this is what Greg's brother Voss got me. And I just tried to take something out of the bag and I just like broke my nail in like a really awkward place. So that's fun. So yeah, um, Greg's brother Ross, um, he's so sweet. Like he got me, I've been looking wanted to try this for ages but it's so cute that he got these i've been wanting to try the normal um caramel filled chocolate in general like so it was thought it was so cute that he got these I, I was so happy with that like i've literally been wanting to try it for like the longest time and then he got me the makeup revolution um sally palette i took it out the, the outer packaging so that i could show you guys how cute is that it's so cute like it sold out super fast which was like insane so like greg must have been like really there when 
they brought it out like i really hope they bring it back because i know that my cousin's like obsessed with like tim burton and like the nightmare before christmas so like i think it would be really cute sorry i just put that in the bag next to me i tried to be subtle but i noticed it like go there um so it'd be really cute to get her one of those he also got me this makeup revolution palette which is so cute that my grandma was acting up me i had but how cute is that oh i love it so much it's so cute like the colors are so lovely it's so thoughtful i love when people are so thoughtful it's like really cute i actually forgot about one but i got a card from my mum's birth dad um he got us a card with 50 pounds in it which is so generous um i don't really know him fully like because my grand my grandma split up with him when i was like a small baby and then they re like my grandma remarried to the man that i actually classed as my papa so like there's a whole situation there that's why i said that but like that's fine so i'm very grateful that you know he still thinks of us and you know gives us money which is really really kind so from Greg's mum and dad, I got, she, they got me the Jaclyn Hill Ring the Alarm Morphe palette. So it was the collection that they done together. It's so pretty. Um, so hopefully there is no issues with this one. Um, I think that was that one, yeah. They also got me the Jaclyn Hill Bling Boss Morphe palette, which is really pretty as well. Oh gosh, I just like nearly dropped it. Yikes. Um, <laughs> which is really pretty as well. I don't actually know who Jaclyn Hill is, but I think it's a really pretty palette. Like I'm, I've heard that there was drama surrounding her like launches and things. So like, I'm sure it'll be fine, hopefully. Um, They also got me this Jeanne Arth Arthens Paris Amore Mio Forever perfume, which looks like this. I'm like so excited about the lid though, like, like it's not even really a lid because it doesn't really cover it fully but it's a snake and it's so nice but it's really cute Um, it smells amazing too and I think it's definitely coming going up there with like a favourite I like a favourite um, perfume for sure Um, they also got me um, Marie socks so there's these ones these ones oh and then the one where she's just like, nope. Um, I love Marie and their trainer socks as well. So it's so cute. They also got me a set of six luxury eye brushes, which I'm so excited about because I really need some extra like, like more eye brushes because there was some that I kept trying to use and I'm like, Megan, stop. They're like not working out very well. They also got me um, the Wild Strawberry Candy Kittens. Like, I knew that they have them in, like, a pouch, but I didn't know they'd done them in, like, these cute little tubs. So, they're so cute because they're vegan. So, that's so sweet. And they also got me some sheet masks, which I love sheet masks. So, there's the Seventh Heaven Tea Tree Sheet Mask, which is for oily and combination skin. So, that's exciting. So, stimulates and wakes up skin. So, that's exciting. Um... There's the dead sheet mask, um, use weekly. Oh, exciting! I'm thinking best. I don't know. I don't think Arasta has these. Or shop near us does. Then there's the reviving masking orange flower and ginger sheet mask, invigorating orange flower extract and ginger help uplift and refresh. <laughs> Suitable for vegans, cruelty free, and pro bean free. So that's also exciting. They also got me these um sandals which is so nice and um, they also got me this top for the summer which is really nice like this with like the wavy hair would look so cute for sure um they also got me these they're quite like they're, i think they're like quarter length um workout bottoms which is really exciting um, they also got me these shorts, which I really needed shorts, so that'll be good for the summer because I don't always have like denim shorts that are like, they don't like, or I do have them and they like don't fit properly anymore, so like, it's fine. Um, there's this top also, like I'm not really sure, it's kind of like, I 
don't really know how it works. So like, it's a bit confusing. There's, okay, so this is the back. I think it's like that, something like that. So that's cute also. So yes, we'll get on to Greg, finally. <laughs> So we're on to the final person, which is like insane. Like you should have, you like see when you see everything, you'll be like, whoa, because I was even shook because Greg is just so generous. Like it's unreal. Like I literally said to him, like, you don't have to buy me this much. Like, honestly, like I'd be grateful with anything that he gave me. Um, so I'm just like, you don't have to do this. Like you could have just bought me like one thing and I'd still be grateful. Like. But I know it's not about giving or receiving, but it's like he really kind of went overboard. And I feel like maybe he was kind of compensating for the fact he hasn't seen me in three months, which I feel awful for. Um, because obviously he really didn't have to do that at all. Um, but yeah, I'm going to stop rambling. I'm going to show you because everything is so amazing. So I'm going to start off with this one. He got me another stitch. Like I have so many stitches because of Greg and it's so cute. Um, it's like he's like realized that I have a giant Marie from last year. I have another Marie, um, like the medium one. And then I have like a lot of mini Maries. He's now working on other ones. So I got the Christmas 2020 um, stitch with the little hat. He's so cute. Cause I got the one that lights up last year, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, we got little stitch. Um, we all, he also got me um stitch fluffy pajamas, which after this video I am getting these straight on because they look they feel so soft and are just gonna be so comfortable. He also got me these thumper pajamas, which are from work, but like work's pajamas are so good. Um, they just like feel so soft. I really need to sort everything. Um, at some point as well. Um, oh, he's just so cute he got me this hype thumper bag it's so fluffy and soft i was like i know this might be weird but i really have to get a picture of me in my thumper pajamas with the thumper bag on like what a combination um while we were kind of on the stitch subject he also got me the emp exclusive special edition santa stitch with scrump it's so cute look at him He's so cute. He also got me the Flock Special Edition Remix Funko Pop because I've been collecting these ones. So like this helps com complete the collection. So that is very exciting. Oh, I also got a bag of Quality Streets, um, which I'll probably share or just like spread it out since I can't have lots of dairy. He also got me a gaming mouse for my laptop, which is super nice. Um, because I've been really wanting to play Planet Zoo <clears throat> on my computer on my laptop, but you need the little scrolly thing on your mouse to like do a lot of the things. So this will really help me play that on my computer because I don't have the mouse. I've kind of just not been able to play like a lot of games on the laptop, but I also need to sort a setup as well. So. This will definitely be beneficial for sure. Um, oh, he also got me a portable charger also. I think it's the same one I got my dad, if I'm being honest. But what is so exciting because I really, really did need a new one. Um, the other one I had was... Um, it's only because I was clumsy and I kind of dropped it by accident and it just didn't hold a lot of charge. And then I got the new fast charging cable for the iPhone. So like it doesn't have the same USB thing. Um, as the other one so it was like very confusing he also got me the book of magic beauty bay palette it's so beautiful like look how beautiful that is it's so nice um i haven't even looked at the shade names but they're okay i'm looking at them now but it's so cute like i do really love that i think i'm actually eyeshadow palette it out this year he also got me the Beauty Bay Bright Matte Palette, which looks like this. I thought I just put my nail on that and I was like, no. So that is exciting because I really feel like with this one, although it's just the matte one, like you could do like majority of your eye look with this palette. Like you could do like a smoky eye and then like you could, you'd probably then have to go to another palette to get your, you'd probably have to get 
another palette for the sparkly bit um but it would still work out while we're on palettes i'm just gonna go through the other ones that he got he also got the beauty bay pastels palette which looks like this if you haven't seen it um it's so cute though like i've been wanting this palette for such a long time because it's so cute and small but it's like so different and like i just really wanted to try and make an eye shadow like a pastel eye look um i thought that would be really cute he also got me the Jack Skellington Revolution eyeshadow palette, which is so cute. It looks like this. So this is what one side looks like. And then the other side looks like this. Sorry, the ring light's reflecting off the stuff on it. So it's kind of annoying. He also got me the Squishy Pineapple. So it's like a stress reliever, but i don't think a lot of people know the joke like the inside joke that everyone has with me about pineapples so like i went to stage school stage coach which is a stage school for kids to teenagers um and we did like this improvised like it was no it was a devised performance not improvised <laughs> um and we made up this like bit about um superheroes and they were in like a rehab facility so i came up with this idea of penelope the pineapple and her <laughs> and like so basically they're in this rehab facility for things that go wrong like their powers are out of control and um my power was that i turned people into pineapples because i had a nut, al nut allergy so now we have this running joke about penelope the pineapple so this is why he got the, the pineapple because it's like a running thing of pineapples penelope and all that jazz um he also got me one of the new pokemon tops it's charmander which is so cute i love charmander so much he's so adorable so i cannot wait to wear that i'm really excited about this one too he also got me this xbox t-shirt which is so cute and um, it's so cute though because um i mean not i don't really tell people this all the time because i don't really feel the need to but because i am bi he was like oh megan like this is pretty much the bi flag isn't it and i was like almost except the blue bit is like a darker blue in the flag and then there's obviously the green but it does look like it could be the the bi flag for sure he was like oh that's cool then and i was like oh that's sweet um but yeah <laughs> um I, he also got me this height these hype joggers they're cuffed and they're just like plain pink so they look like that um oh they have pockets yeah wait do they actually have pockets or did i make that up <gasps> no they do oh i love it when joggers have pockets see when joggers don't have pockets it's such a lie like they lie to you and then i got this hype hoodie which matches the joggers which is so exciting because i've never i don't think i've ever had like a two-piece matching set like for joggers in like the longest time i've never had anything from hype so like that's exciting as well and lastly thankfully we're at the end and thankfully i had it more organized in the christmas eve video he got me these adidas trainers which are so nice and because they're green my mum is literally freaking out wanting to take them because she's obsessed with green green is her color um but they're so generous um i probably wear those going out walking because i actually did need shoes for going out walking again like for like i do have some but you know it's good to like mix up a bit and not always wear the same ones i guess um but yeah like i'm so grateful like everyone went above and beyond like this christmas and i and i do think it probably has contributed to the fact that this year has been crap um but everyone really didn't have to do half of what they did like it's just incredible what everyone has done and i'm like eternally grateful for everything that i've received i love every single part of it and now it's just the fun part where you've got to find the space for it <laughs> and i'm gonna probably have to take these all back downstairs though because i have to put the bloat bed back down where i'm sitting so i can't even just leave it here then obviously like after today which is boxing day i will 
have to find a space for all of these and like get rid of all my old clothes and all that fun stuff but yes that this is all what i got for christmas and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys on the next one thank you guys so much for watching bye